everybody, it's Gamer Rocky. We're back with Banjo Kazooie. Last time we got to freeze Easy Peak and uh, enjoyed climbing all over a Christmas tree and this beautiful music and snowflakes falling from the sky. Catch him on your tongue, man. Catch him on your tongue. You're not gonna even try. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. So I could use this flight pad. And now that I see it, I, f I feel like I should. At the same time, I don't want to. You know what, let's just do it. I, I think we have actually have to uh, attack his buttons. And I only have 14 red feathers. Eh, that's not good. You have to attack your target like buttons. Oh boy. Uh -oh. <laughs> Woo! Gotcha! Gotcha! See if I can hit them all without using a single red feather. That would be pretty elite. Uh -oh. <laughs> Not really, you're falling down. It would be leader if you were doing it upwards. It would be like impossible. Uh -oh. Uh, yeah. oh, wait, it does use red feathers when you charge. I forgot about that. He just pooped that out. I guess all those jabs to the stomach weren't so healthy after all. Sorry. At least it keeps you regular. Booyah. Got your poop. Snowman, snowman, poop, poop jiggies. That is pretty neat. Maybe I shouldn't have killed all those other snowmen. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Wow, he has enormous legs. And there's the third present already. I'm already getting lost here. <laughs> Hello. Take me to the kids. I'm the last one. Yes, you are. How'd you know that? How did you know that? Okay, then. I, I guess I'll just go up here. Yeah, boy. So you might notice all that stuff in the water. I think we have to actually do Mumbo's transformation to do any of that stuff. What the heck? Ice cubes! You're being awfully rude! Just saying. Oh, wow, there's red feathers on the red stripes and notes on the yellow stripes. <laughs> That's cool. Very clever. Very clever. And they're both things I need. It's a scarf of justice. It's quite a scarf you got there, man. Quite the scarf. There's a sled. Okay, well now we know where that is. <laughs> I want to get this Jinjo. He's been like waiting real patiently. Ooh, hello. Your broom's got a little snow on it, man. It's got a little snow on it. And I think there's something in his pipe. Sneaking suspicion because it's a very dangerous thing to do. There's a jiggy in there. Wow. So weird. Okay. Well, I think we're pretty much done with Mr. Mr. Snowman here. Mr. Frosty. He never did say his name. I guess he's not even alive. Which is okay. I'll call him Frosty. And let's take this. Oh, woo! Ikamokam. <laughs> yeah. That suits that well. Ooh! That's better. Hey, you found my sled. I'll go and practice for the big race now. See ya, buddy. See ya, Boggy. Big race. Dude, why was your sled way up there? What the heck? 
It's awfully strange, my friend. Awfully strange. Okay, so let's give these kids their presents while we're here. <laughs> Cheer up, kids! You have presents! Here you go! Here you freaking go! Wow, thank you, brown bear! No problem. Yippee! Now we've all got our presents! Here's for you, thank you! You gonna open those? I kinda wanna see what's in them, they're bouncing around. It's like living animals. Save them! Hey, wee! Well, oh, they're pretty happy. I guess they just wanted the wrapping paper. Cool. Alrighty, uh, what are we doing? I don't know. Missing stuff for sure. There's that town I've never gone to. There's this ramp up here that I think is a race that I'm afraid of. And there's just some other stuff that I missed, so I'm, I'm just gonna keep going this way. I don't want to miss anything! Much needed. Phew! It's safe for Waza to come out now! Come out? Hi, Waza! Whoa, you have a jiggy, Waza! What are you doing? What are you doing there? Yikes! A nasty fierce bear! Nasty fierce? I'm not, I'm not nasty fierce, I'm not pretty nice actually. Just, uh. You're afraid of me. You're afraid of me, uh, Waza. Oh! Very, very bouncy blubber there, Waza. Was that? Was that? <laughs> Was that, Waza? Oh, uh, what the heck am I talking about? Oh, here's the finish line. Hey, look, we got first place already. Woo! Woo! So we'll just wait here for Boggy to show up and he'll learn that he's not as good as us. That sounds like the best plan. We got a trophy and everything. <laughs> Wonder if what, that's why they put that there. Because it is a trophy. Anywho, I don't think we can win a race that way. As much as we'd like to. Waza, don't be afraid! Okay, so I guess we can go to the town now. I think, maybe, possibly. It's kind of off. Kind of off on the beat there. <laughs> Whatever. Whatever. One thing I don't like about recording with my capture card is I have to listen to the game through really low volume so it doesn't pick up through my mic, so like a lot of this music I can barely hear. And it blows because music's one of my favorite parts of this game, and it's like, come on, man, come on! I could use headset. Headphones. But I'm wearing a headset to record, so if I wore two sets of headsets, I would look like a goober. And then my mom comes home, she's like, hey! Goober son, what are you doing wearing your goober like double headset? I'm not quite no, I just wear my double headset. Gee, why you gotta be so crazy? No, she's not crazy. <laughs> I don't know where I inherited my craziness from. Oh, anywho. I need to get I need to get over there. There's no there's no boots on my side. be somewhere. Unless I'm just supposed to fly over there. Which could be the very much case. And then uh, we made full circle, pretty much. Just let me get this! Okay, I'm pretty sure, yeah, Boggy's just up there ready to, ready to race. I think. So we're gonna take this flight pad over here. And do Mumbo's uh, thing here. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Good do! Whoa, <laughs> there's a token there. I want that extra life. Uh -huh. 
Grazie. I don't want the. I really didn't want those boots. I really didn't. Wow, even his skull looks like it's all frozen. Hello, dude. I hear a Jinjo you've trapped in your hut. You know, it'd be a lot better if you weren't helping Grunty. If, if you're trapping a group of Jinjos, stockpiling of empty honeycombs, and then sleeping on the job. Come on, man. Come on. Everything behind you. Chair. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Danjo got old fat. Got big teeth. I I do have very large teeth. I'm a walrus. I'm a walrus. Maybe Waza won't be so afraid of me now. So yeah, as a walrus, we can actually go in the water and not get hurt by its freezing nip-nips. Jack Frost is rather kind to the blubber fool. Uh. So we can get all this stuff in the water. Yeah, yeah. There's a lot of notes right here. So we're only missing four. That's like one area worth. I'm coming, Waza! Wait for me! <laughs> Walrus banjo. Look how ridiculous he is. <laughs> flop, flop, flop. Belly bouncing is what I like to do. Look at my teeth. They're so very, very long. That's just great. What walruses need to survive! Hey, oh, oh. hey Waza! Whoa, another walrus! Take this! But watch out for a smelly brown bear and his ugly bird partner! Smelly? You said he was scary, not smelly. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? What's in your cave? Ooh! Digging the, I'm digging the giant crystals. Well, hello, good Mr. Walrus. Feel free to have a look around. I, I like how my accent for the plaza is changing every time. You have a Jinjo in here, and I'm too tiny to grab it. So I guess we have to come back. Come back when you like a Jinjo. And I'll let you know that you got a Jigga too. Jig, jig, jig. Wow, we found both empty honeycombs this time. Heck yeah! Thank God. Oh! He Ice Cube, why don't you slide in a random direction? That would be appreciated. I'm liking all these crystals. They look so cool with their glows and their sparkles. Beautiful! It's beautiful! I feel like I'm Superman. Super Walrus Man. Is that all you have in here? Is a Jinjo man? Or woman? <laughs> I don't know. Too afraid to check. Anywho. Let's see. I can't remember... I think we have to race Boggy as a walrus. I have that strange suspicion. Yeah, yeah, let's go see. Let's go see. Here's the last four notes. Yeah, yeah. Just holding on to these, man. Okay. Bottles. <laughs> hey, Mr. Walrus. Fancy a race? Hop on the sled if you do. I guess. I, I get it. Um, 
Jeez. Great, now all you need to do is steer your sled through the red slalom gates and beat me to the end. Got it? Three, two, one, again. Oh boy, here we go. These races can be tricky. Woohoo! Hey, Boggy. Whoa. Stay away. I swear to God, if you make me miss a slalom gate, I'm gonna kill you. Oh, you jerk! This is tough, this is tough, this is tough, it's really tough now. He goes faster and slower like a jerk. This part's hard. Don't miss him, don't freaking miss him. See, look, he goes faster. God, I hit you, Boggy! I think jumping may have slowed me down. <laughs> Maybe. Okay, we got this. We got this. Go, go, go! Freaking go! Yes! Woo, that was close. Whew. You're too quick for me, Mr. Walrus. Here's your medal. I reckon I need to raise someone my own size. Your own size? Are you applying... Are you applying Banjo's fat? Are you saying Banjo's little fat dad? Are you saying he's fat? I'm not saying you're fat. <laughs> Maybe I am. Yes! First place for reals! But in walrus form. Woo! So I guess that's pretty much all we can do as a walrus. Not, uh, not too much. Mumbo token! Belly flop. <laughs> Yowchies. Is this slope really steep over here? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Not too bad. Oh, this world is so cheerful. <laughs> Fantastic. Change me back, Momo. Change me back. Wake up. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Z man. All right, so now we can go into Waz's cave, get the last Jinjo. And I think the other Jiggy's from. Boggy? But we have to race him as Banjo, I think. I think, I think, I think. Oh, make it! Make it! Ooh, 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 that was close. <laughs> it was real close. I'm coming, Waza! I may be smelly and scary, but I'm definitely not. Well, I'm hairy as well. That's okay. I'm told that's genetic. Fly in. <laughs> yep. Hey there, Waza. Don't mind me. <gasps> oh my god, it's the crystal key! Wow, that music was great. This is open? this open? Maybe that's just in this remake they opened it. Because I think before you had to have like a special code or like special version of the game to even get in here or something. I, I don't know. The original was really hard to get all this secret stuff. So you can just go and grab it. Cool! An enormous ice key! We should keep this stop and swap item for later. Okay. Sounds good to me. My phone is ringing. My phone be ringing right now. Hey there. Hey, the bear again! Take that noisy orange thing with you and leave poor Waza alone. 
Oh, you're, you're such an unhappy walrus. Such an unhappy walrus. <laughs> well, at least we at least we took the annoying orange thing. Jinjos can be a little bit uh, rowdy, I guess. So yeah, I guess we're only missing that one Jiggy from uh, Boggy. Well, let's go find him. It's like right across the pond, right across the pond. <laughs> Close call jumps all over the town. Hey there, man. Hey, buddy. Fail to your race against Boggy? Sure. Chicken out. You say chicken out just like Mr. Vile. Oh, I don't have speedy shoes. Shoot. I don't think I can do this yet. Run through the red slob gates. Try to beat me through the end. Let's do it. Yeah, I think you need speedy shoes for this. Look how fast he is. Yeah, you definitely do. Master, you're not trying back there. Come on. Wow. This is too easy. I'm giving up. Well, perfect. Let's win. <laughs> oh, well. Come on, buddy. Try it. Why would I try again when you've obviously just completely annihilated me? You're a jerk. Okay, so yeah, we definitely have to come back with speedy shoes. That is interesting. Hey, that means we're pretty much done with Freeze Easy Peak for right now. Yeah, yeah. Yippee skippy, yippee skippy, yip, 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 skippy. Goodbye, Christmas theme. Goodbye, Christmas. Goodbye, snow. Goodbye, ice. Goodbye, cold weather. Goodbye. Goodbye. Come back. Sometime. <laughs> I guess the speedy shoes are in the desert level! Oh, poop. You were in the real world now? Ow. Of all the enemies they could have taken. Why'd they have to take that one? Speedy shoes. Oh boy. Yeah, this is totally an advent calendar. Wow, that's so cool. That's why it has all these little holes in it. How am I supposed to... Oh, wait, there's a flight pad. Ah! I guess that's how we get the, uh, jiggy. <laughs> Hit! Oh, wait, this is a temporary flight pad. Yeah, and that's why we need running shoes. Why do I talk all the time? It's really hard to make these rhyme. <laughs> I don't know what I was doing there. I did the jump pad one I didn't mean to. Yeah, that's gotta be the only way to get up there. Okay. Well, I guess that, uh, that's not much to really do other than doing itself. Doing. What's the doing? How do you get past these webs? I really don't remember that. Ooh, wow! Double teaming! Jerks. Seems like something you could just slam. Oh. Eggs. <laughs> Figures. Hello. Now that one we've seen before. Yeah, yeah. That's it. You've cheated a shortcut. Or created. <laughs> oh, man. These bees are gonna kill me, aren't they? Oh, no! Oh, no! Get away! I just want... I just want... I just want those. See ya! <laughs> Sorry, bees! I'm a jerk. Alright, so we can open the grunty mouth door. I guess we can even open that one up there, but uh, I want to do this one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Please tell me this is where I want to go. 
have a sneaking suspicion this is gonna lead to Mad Monster Mansion. <laughs> oh, here we go. Oh, Gobi's Valley! That's what it's called. Yeah, yeah. I don't like stairs much in my lair. They always make me gasp for air. That's true. You have a lot of uh, ramps going on. All right, so there's a Brentilda up there in a little hole. And I'm pretty sure this leads to Mad Monster Mansion. So yeah, <laughs> we're just gonna go back to Gobi's Valley. Gobi's Valley. Gobi's Valley. My mouth is creepy. She has no teeth. Uh. So what's up here? I'm gonna get distracted for for a second. <laughs> Seeing as how we can open this, I'd like to know. I think we're closing in on Rusty Bucket Bay. I think we are. <laughs> just, just, uh, just to make sure, I'm pretty sure this is where this is going. That was not a goldfish. Oh God, it is. No, get away. Quit nipping. Oh my god, that thing's vicious. Just hang out down here. <laughs> Ugh, rusty Bucket Bay. Oh my god. That level's gonna be the death of me. Actually, I haven't died yet in this LP. It's pretty good. I almost died. <laughs> because of Mr. Vile. And because of the water in the... I almost died twice in that level. Oh, not another goldfish. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, oh god. Probably not supposed to be doing this right now. I'm just... <laughs> I'm wasting time. I'm wasting lots of time! Mad Monster Mansion! Ooh, that level's so cool! It's so cool! <laughs> I cannot wait for that! You look evil! I'm pretty sure you can kill these things. Like this. Yep. Sure can. My filthy bed gives me a rash. Never, I never wash. I save my cash. We well, have enough water in here. You could at least somewhat bathe. I don't know. Okay. Well, I, I guess we're done in here. <laughs> For now, anyway. And we know the next two worlds we're going to. I guess we'll do Gobi's Valley first, just because. I think that's where the speedy shoes are. Hopefully, hopefully. Now that's one thing uh, Banjo Tooie did um, that this game didn't do too much is getting powers in other levels and then backtracking. You don't really have to do that too much in this game, but in Banjo Tooie, it's like. A huge part of it. You have to backtrack so much. And there's like the worlds linked together and everything. It's oh man. Oh, it's almost it's almost overly confusing, honestly, but it does extend the length of the game quite a bit. 
Ouchies. It's okay. Just get right back up and uh, get out of here. Okay, um, okay, um. What are those boots? And where am I going? Come on up here. Yes, I am. Okay, I want these boots. So I don't die. Looks like her legs get longer. <laughs> she puts on boots. Go, go, go! Yep, that sand is not healthy. As you might expect. Oh, hi, Brentel. How you doing there? Grunty's best friend at witch school was the awful Sweaty Betty. Sweaty Betty. Oh, God. When relaxing, she usually reads Big Butts and Guts magazine. While sipping a glass of her favorite camel spit milkshake. Oh, you poor dears. Your energy is low. Wow, I didn't know you refilled my health. Thank you. You're a little bit more helpful than I thought you were. <laughs> She's pretty helpful, but... I'm still... I don't think I'm going to remember half that stuff she's saying. Ugh. There's just so many of them. Anywho, I think I'm just going to end this part here, guys. Next time, we'll head into Gobi's Valley. Hopefully not get our feet burned on this hot sand. Ouch! Ooh! Ah, hot! Hot! Ooh. So yeah, see you guys next time.